Hello. Thank you for joining me at IChooseMyEconomy.com. Here we've been talking about how do you choose your economy? See, there's a problem that I see in America. I think most people see this. Most people look at life and they say, inflation and all the things that's going on in this life is causing them a problem. They're struggling to make what we call ends meet. So don't you think about that for a moment. I used to hear my dad say things like this. I can't never make ends meet. Every time I do try to make ends meet, someone cut me off in the middle. Do you find yourself, when you walk through your life and in your day-to-day -day life, do you find yourself, every time you seem like you're trying to get straight, you say, I'm working hard, I'm working an extra job, picking up extra shifts at work, trying to make extra income so I can get straight. And by the time you start to look like you're getting straight, you have a problem with your vehicle. You, you, you have a breakdown or something has to be repaired. Or maybe you're involved in an accident on the road and you have to pay a deductible. Like, wow, man, somebody just cut me off. Well, other things like, of course, if you're raising a family, as I have and many of you have, you have your children in after-school programs. And then, of course, now they may have to buy additional expenses, additional school supplies, or pay additional fees to participate in those events. Man, I was amazed here. I have a niece who's graduated from college this year. And all of the things now that her parents and her are involved in that has extreme costs for her to graduate, as opposed to when my children graduated college, we just had a simple graduation and you had a dinner and that was it. We're trying to make ends meet. Now, as with Alvin Curry, even as we speak, I have to have an appliance guy come to my house tomorrow to check on a couple of my appliances that went down. That's supposed to go bad. That's not, I can't make ends meet. That's not somebody, someone cutting me off in the middle. That is, these appliances are not supposed to last forever. They're going to have problems. You have unexpected loss of a loved one. Unfortunately, someone is going to die unexpectedly in all of our families. All of us are experiencing loss of a loved one. Sometimes that's a loss of income that was a significant to the family, what we call the breadwinners. All of this is not someone cutting me off in the middle. This is because we have not properly prepared to take care of our economy. So I want us to understand this. We are supposed to, day one we get a job, we're supposed to go to work, and with that income, we should be, start to build a retirement income. And we're supposed to build an emergency fund. And if we would build an emergency fund, now we have car trouble, now we have to pay a deductible or we have to pay for appliances from our emergency fund, we will pay those things and solve that I can't make ends meet. If we have an unexpected loss of a loved one, we're supposed to have insurance so that in the event we can't replace the loved one, but in the unexpected event that a loved one is lost and the income of the breadwinner is lost, the life insurance is supposed to replace the income to the family. And so we're supposed to work and save about 10% of our working income so that one day when we retire, we will have enough income to support our lifestyle in our retirement. So if you're struggling with this on how do I make ends meet, you're struggling with I'm behind Alvin on all of these things, I can't make ends meet, then reach out to me at trustalvincurry.com or you can follow me on LinkedIn and reach me directly there and we can have a conversation on what God has shown me and taught me over my lifetime of how I fix my life. So if you look at some of my other videos, it'll tell you where I started from and it'll tell you what God has done for me in my life today. So we have to challenge what you're hearing out here in social media today. You're going to get your life fixed quick, but we're going to talk about that and how that's going to work for you. I can't make ends meet. We have to talk about that and how to fix that. So again, you can reach me at trustalvincurry.com or you can join me on LinkedIn, follow me on LinkedIn 
and we can have a conversation. Thank you for your time. I bless you.